Hey guys, we have made it halfway through the year. It is July the 4th tomorrow, Ooh. or maybe you listen to this on July 4th. We're going to spend some time celebrating what it means to be American. America. We got to talk about the debate debacle, a little bit about the election. Baiting. Baiting. We're going to talk about fireworks. Hawk to a girl has come out of hiding. Hawk we all know who she is. What's your favorite 4th of July food? And then we're going to argue about 4th of July movies. But first and foremost, Father Fortenberry, how are you this fine? I am doing well. Uh, you got Father Fortenberry here. You can find me at fatherfortenberrygmail.com. Email me, send me pics, whatever. You know, I like them all. <laughs> Gary. Hello, all. Thanks for joining the show. Uh, happy 4th of July. Uh, only thing we're liberating, t- liberating tonight is another bottle. Ooh. Ooh. No taxation no, without representation. That's right. We ain't pouring this in the in the the. the what you got there? In the ocean. I'm gonna go lay in the ocean. Clock. E. H. Taylor, right. small batch. All right, Marty. What's up, guys? Uh, welcome. <laughs> Happy Fourth. Uh, Barber Nerd here. Just trying to get this show on the road. D. W. What's going on with you, buddy? Yo, what's up, America? America. All right, let's jump right in. Look, we went live during the debate last week, so unfortunately we didn't really get a chance to uh, listen much to it, really. No. Hop to it. Anyway, we didn't get to hop to it. Hot. No, we didn't. But it was uh, it was quite the debacle such that everyone's saying Joe Biden needs to step down. Is that not the most America thing you've ever heard? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes. But I do know this. I think – I probably have the same favorite line that everybody else has. Which one? About your handicap? Yes, yeah. about his handicap. Yeah. I know you're swing. Is it the fact that he swing. can't walk, talk, or, or you Yes, he said he's handicap. a six handicap. But he went to eight later on in his speech. He's like, I was a six. No, eight. But uh, he was still lying. How how American Look, man, is I saw. I saw him walk down the stairs <laughs> yes. after the thing, and there's no way he's just. You mean how he was? Maybe he just said. Maybe he just meant I'm handicapped. How he was led down the stairs. <laughs> you aren't taking an account. They swing from the senior tees, guys. Look, I think I shoot a 19. I think last time I figured it out, I shoot a 19. That was like four years ago. Oh, you're right. It's probably like a 22, 23 now. Yeah, see, he's even lying about his handicap. <laughs> so there's I've no never way. had one. I there's no, no what what there's no way this guy can beat me. I don't play by myself. He's using I'm that a... foot wedge. I don't believe either one. He can't use a foot wedge. He would fall if he tried to use a <laughs> foot wedge. Can't kick him very far. He'd go, Secret Service, bring a foot wedge. <laughs> some big old burly dude. Yeah, some big about a suit and kick a ball. I found yeah. your ball. <laughs> Look, so what the the biggest thing to me that came out of this, everyone just thought Kamala Harris was in the background being quiet, and now everybody thinks she's the better choice for president. Look, if you get if the people who support you think that she would do better than you, <laughs> buddy, we are in a world of freaking hurt. I like, a world of freaking hurt. I like uh, where where is she? She's at the White House now. I think Gretchen uh, Whitaker or, Whit- or not Gretchen Wilson. Or Gretchen Whitmore. Isn't Gretchen Wilson a singer? Yeah, she is. Yeah. Uh, Gretchen Wilson, she'd be a better vice president. <laughs> she, I can't have a Gretchen Wilson song either, but I don't know any uh or Biden songs either, to be fair. What's a Gretchen Whit with the girl the girl from uh Whitmore. I said the girl. Whitman? Whitmore. 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 I, Whitmore. I think they're saying she might take his spot. I I don't think anybody can beat Trump except for Michelle. Michelle Obama. A big Mike can win. Yeah. I, big Mike can flat out win. I think she would be the – she's big the only Mike. one that can win right now, and she will win if she runs. Now, they, call this, this, they call this race orange is the, blue black. This is the conversation that will dominate around the, the smoker, around the, the – water cooler. The water cooler, yeah. the tub of beer. Everybody's got their opinions. And at this point, I'm not even sure it's political. It's more about uh, – Picking the most uh, physically fit, and you don't have to be real physically fit to. Uh, so the best meme I saw that. was uh, fit. about the debate. Was it was a scene from uh, Grumpier Old Men where they're arguing? <laughs> That's oh yeah, exactly yeah. what it is. Somebody sent that with the babies. I can't remember who did that. And I yeah, bet the you that babies was funny. Oh, the, the babies ma- was funny. Yeah. What what look, the Michelle rest of the world was like. A, uh, what if Michelle Obama did a be like Mike commercial for an ad campaign? That'd be hilarious. <laughs> Like, the rest of the world school, has to be laughing at us. Yeah. They are. They should be. Look, it's so bad. <laughs> I read something today claiming North Koreans are going into 
are North Korea sending troops to Russia so they can dig tunnels under the front lines of, uh, of, of the war and come up on the backside and attack them. And that wasn't some like rag newspaper. It was some like legitimate uh, intelligence. It's weird. It's I, so damn weird. I mean, my problem. The world's the, weird. The world, the world is, is weird. I need to holler at El Chapo. He got plenty of guys that can do Look, that. Like that. They and here, that we, here we are fixed to vote on somebody born. We had to choose between a guy born in the 30s and a guy born in the 40s. That's ridiculous. <laughs> These are the best yeah, two ridiculous. candidates for America. That's, that's <laughs> really. <laughs> Once again, South Park nails it. Gary, it's a it's a turd sandwich and the giant douche. Yeah, Gary, you have. There's got to um, be a fifty-something year old dude that's much better. Where's Gary, Gen I, X at? Where I was is Gen X. I was in such a good mood for the Fourth of July, and you actually brought it back to reality. It is. You remember the show Dinosaurs? I think I sent y'all. That yes, clip you sent that. Yes. Yeah. And it was, Earl was running for president. <laughs> this guy was a, ty- a Tyrannosaurus, wasn't it? I yes. think, or something like. That. Anyway, yeah. he was, was a Which, warmonger. Tr- Which is Tr- played Tr- by Sherman mm, Hamsley? Yes, it was Sherman Hamsley. Oh, no, no, no. Uh, it was a he, Triceratops. It was yeah, a Triceratops. But, but he was a uh, from Amen and all that. Yeah, Sherman yeah, Hamsley. Yeah. yeah, he was the guy that played the boss. Yeah, yeah, and it said, "Here's the time we have a war between a, a, a psychopath warmonger and a bubbling idiot." <laughs> yes. And it's like, wow. That was like 40 years ago. You guys probably didn't yeah. even watch Dinosaurs. Absolutely. I did. I, yeah, I liked that show. I thought it was great. It's only on for a couple seasons. Not the mama. Uh, so, look, do we, do we really think Trump has a chance to win? Yeah, because I, I, mean, I think he will win, but if Michelle runs, he won't. Dude, he could have teabagged the the dude doing the, <laughs> the debate and won that debate anyway. Uh, it's it's terrible. Waited, like I said, it, they it too depends. Long to no, nah, they haven't. The yes, D, is, they both wear depends. It depends <laughs> on this whole convention thing. And look, you guys, sorry we're talking a little bit more about politics. We try to avoid it. But uh, but we had to talk about that's the news of the day. Let's talk about something more important. Mm-hmm. You guys like miss fireworks. Do you buy fireworks for the 4th July? <sighs> nope, not anymore, no. I went through a stretch a few years ago. I was buying them. They do you buy fireworks for kids? Uh we still have some left over. Like, they're just not that too. interested in shooting them. Back in the day when we shot fireworks, we went to Derek Russell's house, and we used to shoot them at each other. Yep, that's yeah. the best and kind. Like, I don't think that's – I don't. I think that's what made fireworks fun, and now you don't have parents letting kids shoot fireworks at each other. We shoot <laughs> things out of yeah. PVC at I, each other. Yeah. That I used to ride them. around in town, and we'd shoot them each other's cars yeah. out the window and those things. I called Gary – I called Gary on fire. Yeah, I fell down, and he <laughs> kept shooting shoot me with a Roman candle. <laughs> <laughs> we never shot each other from. I, I hit Julian Branch in the eye with one. A Roman fire. candle or a bottle rocket? Bottle rocket. I My shot dog. A Roman candle at him in his hood. It landed in the hood and caught him on fire. Sure did. Wow. I had and a, I continued to shoot him. Yes. I had a dog shoot me with a bottle rocket one time. That gun. I had a dog. <laughs> he grabbed the bottle. <laughs> <laughs> he no, had the pump. No, no, no. I had a dog that would love to chase them. So I was sitting on the porch throwing them oh, out there, and the dog would go grab them. And then it blow. It wouldn't hurt him or anything. But then he grabbed one and turned it around, and it shot right out onto me and said, choo, 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 burn my shirt up. That was funny. Well, it did. I almost had my car blow up one time due to fireworks. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I had, uh, like, I want to say four or five grosses of bottle rockets sitting in the back of my truck. <laughs> And uh, it got one, so hot. One of our buddies named Andy ran up to it and shot a bio rocket, rocket into it, and it set them all off under. It was like under underneath Derek's car. You mean, port. You mean Julian, previous owner? <laughs> yes, 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 Julian. And the car was on fire for a little bit, right under, right beside the gas tank. <laughs> hey, who remembers that blue uh, sunburn I had? The blue you one? You probably don't. I don't remember the blue one. I don't think, I don't think I before I, you knew me. So I had a Pontiac sunburn, and me, I'm driving. Barry Blake is in the passenger seat, and JD is in the back seat, and we have a massive bag of uh, fireworks in between Barry's legs. <laughs> Barry, Barry goes to throw a bottle rocket out of the window. It hits the window, <laughs> falls back into the bag. <laughs> We're going down the interstate. That's awesome. I've been I'm, I I throw this little bitch in park at like forty, <laughs> and somehow JD beats Barry out of the because uh, it only is two door. JD beats him out of the car. <laughs> So Barry's like laying on top of his back, fireworks just going off. So he took one for a team. He, he jumped. <laughs> he jumped onto the hand grenade. 
He's missing <laughs> time. <laughs> Look, yeah, I mean, this car, there's a big brown spot, or black spot in the middle of the floorboard uh, when I saw the right cast. <laughs> <laughs> but um, pump. That's a funny story within That's itself. Oh, jeez. But you know, let's face it. Today's fireworks are not the fireworks when we were a kid. They still have those, but they're they some, still exist. Yeah, but, but they're sophisticated. Like, you buy these boxes, and it looks like you're. At people the, are trying at the to have fireworks center. shows and not. Oh yeah. yeah, just play with fireworks. Oh yeah, because they're awesome. I and you got to, the one uh, little cannon. You drop one in there, and that Joker shoots up, and boom. boom. We took a trip down to Brownsville, Texas one time and went right across the border to a little place called Matamoros. You had to pay like 50 cents to cross the bridge to get in and a dollar to get out. (laughs) And uh, I was probably like 10. And my mom and dad let me buy these fireworks over there. They were newspaper that were folded. Y'all remember the paper footballs? Yeah. Mm -hmm. used to flick. Well, they were probably six inches long, you know, like, Indian. Don't be lying to us. They, they were, no, they were full of gunpowder and had a fuse in them. And we brought them all the way back home. I put bricks on them and shot bricks like 15 feet in the air off these things. That's the kind Those of the fire are real explosives. Okay, real. Who, who here? Well, I'm, I'm going to go to jail. Who here put fire, uh, fireworks and frogs? No, I didn't do I didn't no. know. I didn't oh, know. Me neither. <laughs> I never did that. <laughs> me, me I just heard about it. I heard about this stuff. Shame on those guys. You heard about it one time? <laughs> You're trying to get us in trouble, James. Yeah, shame on those people. He what? Does. What's I the... I got w- mad at Josh Aceto one day because he put a firework in a frog. <laughs> <laughs> What's the one food there for fourth that that jumps out and says it's 4th of July? The glizzies. What's the glizzies? It's a hot dog, man. Man's got to be a hot dog. It's a oh, It's the wiener. I was, was going to say T's ribs. That, that screams 4th of July to me. They actually hot like dogs act, tease actual ribs or, or tease ribs. I'll be able to see them before long. <laughs> I know <laughs> they probably just taste just. I say good. them uh, red circle bees. You got circle bees is where it's at. Dog. That's like a you that's don't have, like a poor man's glizzy. You don't have to do nothing to circle bees. You just slice them in half and throw them on the grill, Look, man. You more man. blacking them. I, I you know. I like mine just when they start curling up. I don't like them black. Oh, I like them black. Oh, my wife likes them black. I do too. There's something about she like them. Your like she that, likes huh? BBCs. Yeah. Yeah. She likes some big cir- She like some big burp. black circles. What? Uh, what hey, about my sister wants you to burn hers as black as the background and the light yeah. from the past? Yeah, yeah, yeah I agree with that. Like exactly. Black. I think so too. BCB. I think eat them. Uh, what's your favorite black circle B? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, BCB, black circle B. Uh, yeah. What, what's your favorite uh, over the counter barbecue sauce? What, or, or what's a barbecue sauce that Blues you hog. like to go with? Which one? There's about good. ten of them. Oh, I like the. Uh, I think it's called the competition. It's one that has a vinegar base. Hmm. You, see, you like you like a vinegar base. I love vinegar base. See, I like too. the the Smoky Mountain, base, the green one. I like the green one. I like the Smoky Mountain. Blue yeah, I know what Gary's gonna say. Sweet baby rays. I, 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 Sweet baby yeah, but that's good on everything. Ah, it's good on everything. It's so you good. put that shit on everything. I put it on mashed potatoes. Put it on everything. <laughs> that, yeah, pretty much. A one. Gary, did you say A one? Huh? What? I like Ron, I like rendezvous a lot. But it's, it's a, a vinegar. I'm not a fan of rendezvous sauce. sauce. I like, matter of fact, I don't like I anything like it rendezvous. I like the hot one, and I like the rendezvous shake sauce. But my favorite barbecue sauce but, is probably Killer Hog. That's good stuff. That's what. What did I say? Blue hog. Blue hog. I, okay, yeah. I actually like blending those two. Blue hog and killer yeah, hog. Killer hog. I like from Malcolm. Tops barbecue sauce. Tops? They do have a good one. Yeah. That's vinegar Tops based too, isn't yeah. it? Sauce, and I like it a lot. I can't remember that one. I, remember. Now, I will say this though. We, they don't barbecue I mean, chicken. The KC masterpiece uh, barbecue. Just something about that makes me think it's. No, you know what's the worst one to me? The. Uh, is it the Heinz? Heinz 99 cents or something? Or used Those to be. freaking things are terrible. That's all my parents would ever buy <laughs> oh. when we barbecued. And it is so distinctive taste to this it's dusty. day. It, is it? It's maybe 15 <laughs> years old. It's dusty. It, it's like it's been in a uh, barrel for a while. Dusty. Yeah. Now, now that, that Cattleman's Honey Gold. Oh, that's awesome on wings. Yeah, wings, yeah. Wing, but I like, wings is 4th of July. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's America. Actually, being a carnivore this year, I'm gonna pick some wings. You're gonna make some wings. That'll be my side. I'll tell you, you make some mean wings. DW, he makes some mean wings. But uh, I, I like the I like to make the Asian wings. Big T. That's does. what I was thinking. The Asian wings. Little Asian That's zing what? on them. Yeah, but you can't do that for the fourth. They gotta be American wings. They gotta be barbecue. Gotta be American so. wings on the first. Smoked, deep fried, and some lard. Now you want to talk about? They get any more American than that right there? It boy. doesn't. 
Man, I wish um, I had some right now. What about Fourth of July movies? Are there any such thing? We had an argument before we went on there. We're going to let you guys oh, decide. Jamie, what? I would argue that the Sandlot is a Fourth of July movie. It does have fireworks. Okay, in it. Yeah. I'll buy so, it. so look, you you couldn't hear this, Donnie. I'll let you be the judge here. I said that the movie The Patriot is an Independence Day movie. Gary said no. I agree. I don't agree. It's about the Revolutionary War. Exactly. I mean, most, <laughs> but that's not the Fourth of July. The Fourth of July is the most that, patriotic movie out there. They didn't even sign the Indo- the, the Declaration of Independence in that movie. It don't matter. We still so? the floor with Damn. a bunch of British people. Independence. I don't. I don't. It's America. Okay. What about so America. then? Gary thinks. Go ahead, Gary. Tell tell everybody your favorite, your favorite July Fourth Fourth July movie. What did I say? I said Independence Day. <laughs> Independence Day. <laughs> yeah, it's good. It's a great one. I agree. I mean, yeah, it's crazy. It's hey, like, I agree too. He comes out and that the greatest president ever makes a speech and says, "This is our Independence Day." It's Bill Pullman. That's I just Bill popped. Pullman. In, just popped in my head. Bill yeah, Pullman. I think Bill, you said Bill that. Pullman. You, you did say that. I did. You talked yourself out of it. No, you did. No, I said no, Gary, Bill Paxton. I said He's Gary Paxton. Paxton. I Gary Paxton. I would get them. I would get them. Bill Pullman. Is that who played him? Bill Pullman. Bill Pullman. Yeah. Can he run for president? I'd vote for him. Give me the same yes. speech, he get my vote. No, I want Morgan. I would say I want Morgan Freeman, but everybody he's president is a, a apocalyptic. Thing there's, a, there's a meteor about. Yeah, to come a down. meteor, a wave. Yeah, every or, time Morgan Morgan Freeman's or, president, everything goes to hell. That means or, or a meteor die. and a wave. Yes, a, me, a meteoric wave. I mean, was he the president of the White House? Has fallen. Who was president? Yeah, he, yes, I think he was. He was. Yes. <laughs> every time he's president, something bad happens. Yeah, White House is falling. Yeah, we don't want him to be president. No, no, we don't. Look, I love you, uh, Morgan. Freeman, but <laughs> hey, was, that, I, was, I the, was I the only one that didn't know he had a, a dead hand, a, a, a paralyzed hand? No, I saw walking I up that. to a, a, a awards and he's. I was like, what? The, what's wrong with his hand? Is it, he has an odd colored glove on? Looks like a, a got a wooden hand. Oh. He looks like a old dude from a uh, Happy Gilmore. Really? He has he a, like chub, a like truly chub. wooden hand. <laughs> no, no, no. He, the glove, made, but he can't move it, so it looked like. Is really? this like a He's a mix between Chubb and Michael No, no apparently it was like a decade ago. He, uh, okay, but when he made his best movies, he could use that hand. When he yeah. was Red and was he, Shawshank. Was and, he an outbreak, too? I believe he was. My God. Was he, he the president? The president? No, no, he, was no, like no he, was, he was like a general or something. <laughs> he was like, my God, he's he's good. <laughs> he's so good. <laughs> Gary's like this Morgan Freeman fella because makes you know good what? movies. When he is president, it always turns out on it the right does. side, right? He's it a, ends what? Well, no, nope, no. Nope. He's in uh, a lot of disaster movies. I think the uh, the one with the meteor that didn't end well, did it? Deep, the deep impact. Deep impact. Yeah, no, but it, the world, the world it just didn't. It, it did. It did. I can't end okay. It ended okay. The world didn't I thought end. So too. Elijah Wood was safe, which we're fine now because he went on to be Frodo. Um, was that that was was that before or after Frodo? <laughs> Probably before. It was before. Yeah, right that before. was like okay. 90s. Is that Elijah Wood or is that the other? Elijah Wood was in that one. He had a girlfriend with the her baby sister, and they rode the dirt bike up on the hills. At the Who's end, the other dude that looks like Elijah Wood. Oh, um, it's not Elijah Wood. No, there's the get. Donnie's right. There's another that looks just like him. No, it's because I always get them confused. Sure, What's the dude like that played uh, Spider Man? Toby Keith, not Toby Keith. <laughs> Toby <Toby's alive. laughs> <laughs> Toby McGuire. That's the most American thing that Toby McGuire's ever been called is Toby <laughs> Keith. Oh, uh, yep. It wasn't Toby Keith or Toby McGuire. I'll tell you that. Yeah, to- it- Toby Toby Keith plays Spider Man. <laughs> <laughs> Does he sing solo cup? Yeah, he's in a he's in a <laughs> He's America. He comes down. He says, "American girl." Yeah, I, that was not Toby Keith. Uh, I can't remember. It's Toby McGuire. To- Toby yeah, McGuire. No, Toby McGuire. Right. He don't look Toby like Elijah McGuire Wood. was Spider Man, but he doesn't look like Elijah Wood. No, he doesn't. No, Especially Elijah Wood. Who played Frodo? <laughs> Elijah Wood. Elijah Wood. Yeah. So the guy that you think looked like Elijah Wood is Elijah hey, Wood. Hey, have y'all ever seen? Uh, I think it was Toby McGuire. Not Toby McGuire. Uh, Elijah <laughs> like Wood. Yes, yeah, uh, played in a. Um, that dog show. Um, <laughs> What's the movie with uh, Air Bud? Oh, it's got. Uh, well, I can't believe that. I can't remember nobody's no, name. You, this is a it's one of like thing. a cartoon. Is a uh, the cartoon? No, no, no. It was a uh, look. It was a uh, man. Sin City. Cat- Sin City. Oh, uh, I, I see. Dude, that, that was an amazing was it, character. Wasn't he like a psycho in that movie? Yeah, he had like sharp fingernails. He'd kill everybody. Yeah, I, I didn't watch the whole movie, yeah, but I knew cool. he was in it. That's one of my favorite movies of all time. Of course, it would be. Yes. 
Sin City. Terry, I got a quick question for y'all. Mm-hmm. Out of the five of us, who'd be the better president? My hands down, me. I mean, yeah, clearly. I, 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 I gotta say, I Terry. Think all, I think we already did that last week. I think it was Terry. Oh, did we do no, that? we said who, no. who would be a, uh, 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 would have been in charge of the cult. Cult, yeah. Terry and Jamie. <laughs> yeah, cult, cult leader. Yeah, still cult. Terry. Cult leader. Same difference. Cult I, look, so I'm gonna say me, I but if I was voting, I'd vote for Gary. <laughs> I'd vote Gary. Gary's yeah, not I tough enough. No, no, yeah. Gary, but Gary's the least likely. Gary's the least likely to to lead us down a bad path. I won't start a war, probably. I would. <laughs> I know you would. I'll be like, there'll be only fans in every home. <laughs> I think I'd vote Marty. Man. I'll Marty there, would have a heart attack before I'll be he, out there slapping he, babies uh, and kissing moms. Me, me and Marty would stress out too much. Yeah, I'd I stress think. out. We'd oh, stress yeah. out way too much. Oh, yeah, Marty would talk for the camera. Oh, Back to the Future was released on the 4th. Well, yeah, but it ain't a 4th July movie, though. Coming to America. I'd vote Marty or Terry, and there ain't no other way I'd vote for the other three of them. <laughs> They'd be calling me no show. <laughs> no show. He'd be, you'd, like, you'd, Marty he'd would be take like more golf trips than Trump and Biden. <laughs> Armageddon came out July 4th. Okay. Oh. Apollo 13. That's a good movie. I'd vote for Jamie to be our, our Surgeon General, though. Uh, that's right. <laughs> yep. That's right. Approved by the Surgeon General. <laughs> South Park Bigger Longer Uncut came out July 4th. Oh, did it? Die wow, Hard really? 2. Had a bunch of good songs in it, too. So, look, Die Hard 2, Die Hard 1's a Christmas movie. Die Hard 2's a Fort July movie. Who knew? Right? But um, wasn't there snow in, Jul- in Die Hard 2? I don't know. There was. <laughs> snow Angel. It was. A, they were in the snow. <laughs> the Patriot did come out July 4th, and it's about... <sighs> Gary, it, face it. Hey, face can it. Top Gun be a... Uh, Fourth of July movie? <laughs> if you uh, want it to be. If you I, want it to be. Hell yeah. I guess so. Sure, whatever. Hey, a little interesting uh, aside, this has nothing to do with Fourth of July. Did y'all know an orca is a natural predator for a moose? Huh? That don't make what? no sense. You talking about a why whale? They eat moose? Why is the why is the moose in the ocean? Hold on, an orca, aka killer whale, am I got that right? Killer whale. Not, not the not the coolers. Hmm. Yeah. So, oh, so an orca can snatch a moose. It's that big. A moose is big. Well, well, a orcas are huge. Does a moose yeah. swim or something? So apparently, uh, meeses will dive down to the bottom and eat <laughs> eat grass from the bottom of the uh, water. From the water. How, how's grass no. going? They said they, can, they said they can. They uh, said they can dive ten meters, which would be thirty no feet. Way. That's a long ways. Dive down and then eat and then have enough breath to get back up. Mm. Yep. That's awesome. I don't believe it. Okay, I got to fact check this. Fact you're, like, check you're telling me. lies like Trump. Fact a check. Debate. Let me check this out. Fact check me. Uh, why you why you fact check me? I'm gonna get me. Uh, where, where's that web weed at? That web natural weed. Natural. You got the weed. There's no way. There's no way. Yeah, An I orca. Say web weed. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe that's where they get caribou crossing from because they be crossing the ocean though. And uh, orca comes up and gets them. All right, Jamie. All right. According to AI and Google. This is the predators for a moose. Bear. A wolf. Okay. Bears. Bear. Okay. Yeah. Cougars. Wolverines. Okay. Wolverines? Really? Whoa, whoa. Wow. And no shit, orcas. Orcas. Orcas a are freaking known. orca. Ain't no way I would ever guess the orca. <laughs> they've been orca. known. Now, they're fifth on the list, but they've been known <laughs> to eat moose. Could you no, imagine? The orca is the ultimate killing machine on this planet, I think. Orcas eat great whites. Like, they work together. Oh, they, yeah, mur- right. they murk they, great whites. They, they murder great whites. Oh, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Look, could you imagine, could you imagine uh, going down the ocean and, like, diving? And look up and see a moose coming at you, then all of a sudden see an orca just, like, <laughs> sideswiping? <laughs> It'll be two of the most shocking things you've ever seen. <laughs> Both the orca and the moose. Well, can you imagine being a 10-foot-tall moose swimming down to eat a crab and get eaten by a giant fish? Man. He's not a fish. It's a mammal. He got That's blow probably hole. the first time you've ever seen the thing. Yeah, I mean. So why don't divers find moose horns? Surely he don't eat them, too. It has to be like the one time National Geographic was filming this orca. <laughs> it happened once. And it happened one damn time. Because it just cannot be they that just frequent. just put them on a list. It cannot be. I wonder if the... Although bass will eat freaking All bass will eat whatever. And Snakes. And yeah. like, Catfish will, too. Catfish eats whatever. I like yeah. how when, when they got an orca at SeaWorld and then it eats the diver that's training and people act surprised. Yeah. I mean, yeah. When you yeah. think of... Yeah. That, How are you surprised? That man? Netflix special is awesome. Killer whale. Yes, yes, it, okay. it's in the name. I yeah, may I, I have a video. Surprised. Now I know what sperm whales are for. <laughs> <laughs> I may have a video. Let me see here. 
<laughs> is this a truth? Oh Charlie my gosh! Like, Hold on, let me pause it. Let me see if I can get this up, Donnie. I think I got to move you to the backyard for a minute. <laughs> the backyard, the backyard. Uh, backstage. He's backstage. Here. Donnie's by the pool. Let's see if I can go full screen. Are they going to show an orca? Right, let's see. Whoa. Let's see what happens here. Donnie, can you see? How's an orca that shallow? Oh, I got to hit play up here. I'm like, what? I'm not going to play the sound because it probably gets in trouble. But okay, here's a moose swimming across the water. That I come oh, on. come look, on, uh, my. Uh, oh, 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 shoot. Oh, oh, I, look, this, oh. <laughs> <laughs> you missed me, bitch. <laughs> 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 okay, that was way better than if it was a true, uh, if it was a real. Than if it was real. Uh, if it was real. Hmm. Okay. There you, you have it. You have it in cartoon form. The uh, orca <laughs> eating the. Um, there we have it. Look, <laughs> proof of what I said was accurate. That's proof. I died. I'm not going to lie. That was awesome. <laughs> I, and I must tell you, I had no idea that was there. <laughs> that was. <laughs> The, uh, oh, look, oh, no. with, with evidence like that, how could I be wrong? <laughs> I thought we were fixing to see it like actually happen, <laughs> and then it went cartoon mode. It did. It did happen. Okay, hold on. Let me see what else. Maybe Clearly, the there's evidence. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> you know, that's just like I saw a documentary one time about these, these little small blue people. So, I mean, you know. I was trying to figure out, smart, trying to figure smart, out why the other orca was recording it. Like, <laughs> under the water. I was like, man, that's tough right here. And the orca's like, all right, get up in there. Let me see what you got. Take me, man. Look, that right there was worth, <laughs> was the, worth awesome. the wait. It was. <laughs> okay, hold on. All right, I so got that cartoon dude made my night. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I think that's the number of moose that have died. Uh, they have life. a number? Yeah. Well, every time the, the orcas will tally, do a tally, and they'll send it to us. <laughs> mm-hmm. so They're smart like that. Something on, at the end of the video I seen where there were some seals on top of the glacier. Maybe, yeah, a know, moose, maybe the moose gets on the glacier and then. Why is the moose on the glacier? I don't know. It broke. It broke. Dice broke, I guess. I don't know. Motor hey, did y'all hear about the, uh, the this supposed, supposedly a true story? Uh, some biologists were in North America, I mean, Northern America, and they ran across a, uh, unfortunately for him, he was an albino grizzly bear. They thought it was a polar bear who'd wandered too far south. And they, tra- they, they tranquilized him, shipped him to uh, the. No way. Yes. Big mistake. <laughs> I'm frozen to death. So this is he's up north. He's cold is, cold. And he's acting weird with, <laughs> up north. So more people find him. They realize it's a grizzly bear. <laughs> Train him, send him back down to the uh, Great North. Then it happens again. <laughs> no. No <laughs> So way. finally they had to move this dude to like a that, sanctuary. That, they got to put him in a zoo. <laughs> okay, <laughs> jet lag. Oh, Lord help us. Lord Could help you us. imagine being a, a grizzly bear in like in the forest <laughs> and waking up, get shot, wake up in the snow? Like <laughs> <laughs> just like, oh, like shaking, <laughs> shaking, and so you know it's the summer of the Olympics, right? This is another is. America thing. When does they even start? They're in Paris. I said uh, August, maybe August. It's real soon. And you know, this is the first year that they're going to have football. U.S. Oh. not this soccer crap, but real, football. real football. Mm-hmm. America, manly football. As long as you wear flags, mm-hmm. pads, flag. It's flag football. Oh, mm-hmm. I didn't know that. Flag football. And apparently, oh. our team's not very good. At flag football? Who's playing on this team? I, I couldn't. Let me find out. Oh, they're pros on this team. <laughs> there should be. Like, look. We don't have a flag football team in America. Not we with NFL. Well, what's what's old what's old boy at Miami? Put him on there. Oh, you're talking about Tyreek Hill? Yeah, put Tyreek Hill on there. He can't be on the team. They won't uh, allow Oh, no I think they are. I think the NFL players are on it. Oh, are they? What NFL play? We got to figure out which ones are on. There's no way it's got NFL okay, players on. in our it's good. It's not going to be There's this no year. There's no way we got beat. Well, maybe it is. Hold on. Yeah, it is this year. It's going to be official in the Olympics in 2028, but I think they're okay. doing like a um, – Like a test. Test this year. Uh, Prototype. Men's, okay, there's nobody on this team. Uh, Michael Better, Amir Brown, yeah, Velton are. Brown Jr., Nico Cesaris from Coconut Grove, Florida. These may be high schoolers. They gotta be high schoolers. They probably college are college players. But I, I hope they uh, end up getting pros. 
Mm-hmm. Oh, I think they will. You know, they're doing that at the Pro Bowl now where they do flag football or something like that. Pro Bowl's such a joke. Yeah, they knew something. Oh, else. yeah. No, that, this American. would be awesome. There ain't, a, there ain't a foreign dude out there that can tackle Derrick Henry out of the Well, there ain't a dude Even in the field that can tackle Derrick Henry. Derrick Henry They're trying, they're they're trying to find local few. people to do it. Derrick Henry can't even tackle himself, man. Yeah, no, nah, it'll be flag because these other – no one plays American football but America, maybe Europe a little bit. Canada got something going on up there. Canada does. I mean, but I know no, London's I, fixing to have a team. I watched a video where a bunch they that America played Japan or something. Yeah, football. They're, they're flag yes. football. But that wasn't flag. It was football. Football. I saw. That's what I said. we lost. Yeah, it was really football. Yes, I yes. That's what I heard. Play. Yes, I saw. I saw. No, I think it's flag football. I saw a TikTok. Well, pads on. <laughs> yeah, they had pads on. You could take Alabama or Georgia's college football team, I think, and win it. Even flag football. I think you take Arkansas and win it against other countries. And win it. Like, yeah, I mean, I, I mean, I, I truly believe that. Yeah, I, th- I thought I saw it. It was real football. I'm mistaken. See, it was real football. And they you lost. 20 How we lose the Japanese folks? Hey, no. Uh, like, that's not we even. We must a, have sent the wrong people. We sent middle school kids or something. I guarantee you, Badman's way more up on their, their sports list than football. 20 to nothing. Whoa. What's our roster? Yeah, full roster here. It's got it's got to be college players. Maybe it's uh, what college players are going to lose to Japan? Well, who? What college team is going to risk their players playing in one of these? I or oh, well, I, I yeah, would. that's that's what I was thinking. I go in a heartbeat. I mean, clearly, I'm not a college player. <laughs> 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 I don't know. I, I can't out jump a uh, uh, women in WNBA. They might beat up. Oh, they they so might beat the patio. Have y'all seen the seven foot three uh, girl from China? Seven foot three chick. Yep, can't dunk. <laughs> can't dunk. I'm not even surprised. I mean, what's her weight? I, I don't. She's seven three and can't dunk. Ninety seven pounds. I mean, when, when she lifts her arms up, she's at least nine, maybe nine and a half foot. Can't dunk. Dang. All right, I'll tell you this. Maybe dunking's illegal in China, and they don't want to do it. I don't know because I've Wilt seen multiple. I've seen a video, and in the multiple video, there's no dunking. She's the woman's Wilt Chamberlain, is what you're saying? He, yes. She's she's about as tall as Gary if he lays on his back. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> let me look at. Let me look her up. Uh, seven foot three. Is she the tallest woman ever? Mm-hmm. I think uh, it was seven foot three. I don't think so. I doubt it. That's a, that's a tall chick, man. Zhang Zhu is her name. Zhang Zhu. That's not how they pronounce the video, but yeah. Zai Yu, maybe? Mm-hmm. Here, I got a picture of her. Hmm. Yeah, she, she's, she's a handsome fella. <laughs> there she wow. is. Wow. She's tall. Oh, wow. Wow. <laughs> Girl, wow. Wow. That's a tall woman. Is it a coach? That's the whole team, I guess. Yeah, wow. She'll be playing in WNBA. Yeah, not, she ain't going to be dunking, though. Probably not. Probably. As you, That's wild, man. As you, man, kid. Mm. She's tall. Hey, I got a question I want to ask you all about hot dogs on this 4th of July. Okay. Yes. Because I'm curious. What's your favorite hot dog topping? I'll tell you mine first. I like coleslaw and mustard. That's my favorite thing on a hot dog. That's, uh-huh. solid. that's solid. That's solid. I like chili. Oh, that's that's <laughs> solid. <laughs> that's America right there. Yeah, I like chili slaw. Ch- ch- chili is American slaw. How about this? Nothing. I want a raw dog with a bun, and that's about it. <laughs> no mustard, no. Terry, Terry, you just like it just raw. Raw bun. dog and a bun. Yeah, Grab that dog, dog, raw dog there on a bun. Go. Well, I like both of y'all's chili and uh, slaw. Yeah, at the same time, yeah. that'd be good too. Oh, no, that's how I eat my chili and slaw. Yeah. Now, what kind of you put jam on yours, right? Gary? Sometimes I've done that before. It's jelly. It wasn't jam. It was jelly. Mm. Grape jelly. But oh, I, man, I, grape jelly would probably be good. I say Donnie wasn't there for that episode. Is there anything that grape jelly would not be good on? I think grape Look, jelly and a hot dog would probably. So be I would bring this up from last episode. <laughs> How's Gary going to eat grape jelly and a hot dog and not drink the peanut butter of banana? I don't like whiskey. Peanut butter. Oh, peanut butter. oh man, that'd mm-hmm. be great. He didn't try it at all. No, no. no. But but this fool it's put good. grape jelly on a hot dog. Sure did. Mm. I, I like putting ketchup, mustard, and relish on mine. 
that's good too. That's that is good. Solid. Well, guys, we uh, it's Fourth of July. You need to get out there, be safe. Don't blow your hands off because everybody <laughs> loses some phalanges around the Fourth of July. Phalanges. Um, uh, get out there, eat good. Uh, a lot of y'all probably go back go back to work on Friday. Uh, if you do, uh, try not to get too hot. Don't drink too much so you're sick all day. But uh, Marty, play us out of here. <laughs> DW Parting Words, then I'm going to put you backstage. Yo, what's up? Coleslaw and mustard. Save me, save me from Father Fortenberry. Got to get that glizzy mm. for the hot dogs, for the fourth. Hey, have fun, guys. Have fun. Gear. Make sure you keep all your spirit fingers. Marty. Happy fourth, guys. Uh, burn them circle bees. Mm, hey Can guys, thanks for stopping by. Hit that like button. Tell your friends about it. We're at uh, like three seven, three sixty something, three seventy something uh, subs. We need all we can get. Hit the like. Uh, hit that button, subscribe. But uh, thanks for stopping by, everybody. Have a good, good Fourth of July. Somebody done save this outlaw.